Let's do our top five best MCU movies. Okay, this, this is, is going to be a tough list. You go first. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> Number five, I have Thor Ragnarok. Okay. Totally saved the franchise by Taika Waititi, mm-hmm. but a lot of learning for Thor in this yeah. movie as well. I mean, Jesus, in the first like 20 minutes, we see his hammer get destroyed. Yeah, and that's really what he used to rely his powers on exactly like that's what that was always his go-to uh-huh. like whenever he faced a difficult challenge or anything like that it was he reached his hand out yep. for his hammer and we even saw that when he first showed up to Sakar. Yep. he reaches his hand out and he's like oh shit yeah it's not there this movie really like forced him to grow and get his powers also hilarious number four i have captain america civil war civil war yes okay extremely good movie i mean How can it not be when you have like almost the entire Avengers cast in this movie? Avengers 2.5. Avengers 2.5. It's almost cheating, but you know, it's still a Captain America movie at the end of the day. Okay. Super good villain with Baron Zemo who figured out the only way that he was going to ever be able to defeat the Avengers because he doesn't have powers was to get them to destroy themselves. Yeah. And just got, he got, bro, he got in their heads like more than Wanda ever could. And that final battle between Captain America and Iron Man is just like so meaningful. Number three, I have Avengers Endgame. Okay. We couldn't have asked for anything more. You couldn't. You really couldn't have. There were so many good callbacks to Uh movies that we've seen in the past. And for those of you that are diehard fans, you picked up on every single one of them. And it was, it made you feel so proud of yourself. Like, I know what that's from. I know what that's from, like every single thing. It's like they're rewarding you on this long journey. Exactly. And although this one didn't focus on Thanos nearly as much as mm-hmm. they did in Infinity War, yeah. you know, he's still an intimidating villain. Number two. Yes. Is Captain America Winter Soldier. Yes. Freaking amazing. Uh-huh. One of my favorite, most rewatchable Marvel movies of all time. Score is amazing. Yep. Villain is amazing with Winter Soldier. I mean, and you have the fall of S.H.I.E.L.D. Yeah. Which is insane. Big moment for Marvel. Huge. This actually meant like a lot more to me because I was really into Agents of S.H.I.E.L.D. at the time. Number one. Number one is the Avengers Infinity War. Okay, good. Infinity War is number one. We have, nobody had ever seen a collaboration like that before. Like we thought we had seen it all with with the original Avengers movie bringing like bringing those six movies together uh-huh. five movies whatever it was some of the coolest shots that i've ever seen in a movie like when thor first shows up to wakanda <laughs> holy shit the theater was going buck wild oh my god i so awesome i'm very shocked to not see spider-man no way home on your list <sighs> it was hard that shocks me 